Hi everyone, Claudia here from Lighting Clarity. I have your channel messages for the week beginning Monday the 17th of July. Please be with me while I connect for you all. Thank you. We have um, Archangel Michael of the Light coming in to be with you all this week. Just bear with me while I make this connection stronger. So for some of you, Archangel Michael is making me feel there's been a breaking away of something. So this is perhaps you ending some sort of a situation with someone, um, ending a job. There's been a breaking away of some sort. Could be doing relationships with the people you used to be affiliated with and now you're not. He's just pointing that out. That's not all of you, but that is for some of you. He's talking about there being tension in the body. He's saying some of you are really, like, I'm feeling tightness in the chest. I feel like you're not breathing properly. There's real tension across the shoulders and across the neck. He says this is actually can impact different areas of your life without meaning to do that. You can impact it. So he's asking you to be more relaxed, to be more calmer, to try and just let go is what he says. He also talks about there being someone around you that is deluding themselves a little bit. It's not for all of you, that will be for some of you, that's deluding themselves a little bit. And there's a real sense of frustration within you when you're dealing with them. He wants you to look at it from the point of view that this is to do with them, this isn't to do with you, he says. Just bear with me, I've just got some noise around me outside. Alright, so Michael's reminding me that he is the life purpose angel. He's not just the guardian angel or the protection angel. He's the life purpose angel and the soul purpose. Right now he's helping each of you with your soul purposes. And he says that you're going to get to where it is you need to get to. And some of you have been quite concerned about um, needing to go where it is you need to go and wondering if you're going to get there and how you're going to get there. He says that you are indeed on the path. He shows me your holy teams are at your backs and they are encouraging you forward. Some of you are toing and froing as to whether the path that is in front of you or that you are on, whether it is for you. And he says, though you are hesitating, he says you are being led in the right direction. He says if you need to change paths or direction, you will know to do that and you will do that. For those who remain on it, that's where you're meant to be. Some of you, he says, you over worry and you overthink things.
he talks about the importance of being in your center and being grounded before making decisions, especially when you're looking ahead down your own path and down your own timelines. Now in closing, All right, so he shows me that there is a small opportunity that's going to come in for each of you. Um, it's not a big life-changing one, but it's a small opportunity that you're gonna go, ah, oh, this is nice, and it's come in. You have a decision to make when that opportunity comes, he says, but I'm, I'm feeling a lot of you will say thank you and you'll take the opportunity. Now, this could be an opportunity of taking a holiday somewhere, new job, <clears throat> or just something. There's something that will be coming. It's not massively life-changing, it's small but it's something that will be coming. It may not be a new job, but there is something that's coming in and it's an opportunity. He says, let me see when it'll come in. For some of you, you've already received the new opportunity. For some of you, you're just about to receive it. And for others, it'll come by October or or a quarter of the way into November. He's talking about the importance of clearing your own paths. He says to call spirit in and ask them to clear your paths ahead so you're able to see the opportunities coming in, so you're able to see the signposts, so you're able to feel which way to go, what to do. He says, call your team in. So I call upon my most highest loving spiritual team of the light to please step forward. I'm asking you to clear my path ahead so I'm able to see more clearly what is coming up in terms of opportunities, in terms of... of um, um, different avenues so I can see my way forward now, a lot of you there seems to be like a there seems to be like a, a shade and I want to say it's from here across part across the heart said it's like it's a bit bigger than across the nose it's up across the eyes um, it's like a blockage here and we want to move that block so you're able to see it's like heavy energy that's there it feels like built up energy that others have thrown at you with their emotions, be it teenage kids, be it partners, be it your colleagues, be it your bosses, be it other people that just thrown at it like a glass in front and you've got this sludge in front of you. Ask them to clear, ask Archangel Michael and Raphael to come in and to clear that. He says to call upon him and Raphael, ask them to come in and clear in front of you as well. <coughs> He says that you can do and embark on the journey that is ahead of you. Some of you think that you can't do this, but indeed you can. He says you actually have more, um, what's the word you're using, Michael? What is that word? You have more stamina and more energy than you realise, in order, and you have all that you need to embark on that journey ahead. Some of you, he says, have been walking um, quite heavy-footed. There's been some... Some different life patterns that you've been needing to to shift to let go of and people that you've needed to deal with and you're realizing that you know what whatever this is to do with this isn't going to happen anymore with this person i cannot deal with them anymore at this level be it a boss um, be it a friend be it a group of people you used to associate with and um he's just saying that that's a realization that's coming in for you it will be and it's a welcome realisation because you feel as though you've been given the permission to let this go and that it's in your highest good and you'll feel that. A lot of you, he says, do believe in the highest good, giving things to God and saying, whatever's in my highest good, I pray and I ask to come about God. And you also ask that of your holy teams, I ask that, you know, the energy of grace come in under the law of grace, this be done. So that means in God's will. Michael says at the moment that he's acting like he's calling himself the director, like a director, like a cruise director or your tour guide. And he says at the moment he's really pointing out the different avenues that are available to you and the different roads that are coming up and what some of those signs mean on those roads. He says he's here to encourage you, give you courage to step forward so you do step forward, so you do progress forward. He says some of you just need a little bit of a push 
because you're a little bit, oh, I don't know. And he says, no, you do know. And yes, you can. And he's going to push you forward along your roads. And this is the next leak that has come in for you. This is the next step that has come in for you. Um, some of you have already embarked on that next step. You did it in June, um, energetic life. And some of you have held back a little bit. But he says, there's only a couple of you who are holding back. You're actually about to take off and be pushed on your roads. He plates you to like little, little baby chicks, if you like, going across being you know, little ducklings being convinced by their mother to cross the road or something like that. But he, he's with you doing that. I'm going to thank him for coming in. All right. Okay, well, we have three spots left on my um, Circle of Light course that I'm running. So it's a series of um, five weeks, four weeks of channeled healings that will be sent on a Friday, the fifth week is a personal channel healing that will be sent to individually to each of you privately. At the beginning of each week, for that five weeks, I'll be sending out um, absent healing specific to the group. Now, I am keeping it small on purpose. I only have three spots left. If you are wanting a spot, please send me a personal message or an email. The way in which I work in the groups is I do come to each of you individually within that recording. You will hear your names. You will feel me working your energy, your His Spirit. I work with the Archangels and the Celestial Masters. I'm saying all this for those who have never worked with me before. So um, that, that's all of that. So I record it via Zoom. It's $428. You're welcome to pay in two parts. We are starting on the 11th of August. However, that's on the Fridays when you'll be sent out the first recording. However, I do start five days earlier, which is on the Monday, where you receive your first um, absent healing, uh, which I'll be sending out. I use... You know, in this course, I use a lot of my light language to bring a lot of shifts within you. We bring down the, the energy codes that are needed for each of you, and each of you are individual with that. We clear um, bl family bloodlines. We also bring healing to the family bloodlines. Um, we do some soul retrieval, retrievals in the course as well. We really do get, um, we do get in quite deep, and you do find that there are those energetic shifts that lift you onto a higher timeline that allow you to see around your life clearer than what you have. Spirit also comes through with a lot of guidance through the recording so you'll hear your name and you'll hear what Spirit's message is to you as well as I do some, some card pulls at the end as well. Alright, have a blessed week and I'll connect with you all again later on. Thanks everyone.